it's taken a bit of time in terms of uh, waiting for, uh, first of all, the squad to be selected, captain to be announced, and then, you know, for me, that's really the starting point of uh, uh, countdown to getting on the plane and arriving in New Zealand. So, you know, really exciting about that. I think it's a very, very strong s squad, uh, lots of options, um, and, and a really, really competitive squad. And, uh, you know, hopefully we go to New Zealand and, and really challenge. The, the strength of the squad that um, we have at the moment, um, the quality of players, and we think that that's improved since 2013. And again, that gives us that sort of confidence and self-belief, and um, to be able to go to New Zealand and think you're going to be competitive, I would go there with the belief and confidence that we can win the series. The, the message to the players is that if you've been selected, you know, to go there with the, the belief and the confidence that you're good enough to start and, and be part of the you know, Test 15. And some of them are obviously going to be disappointed; and they're going to miss out, but. Uh, you've got to put your hand up, you've got to be competitive, you've got to fight hard at trainings, um, you've got to um, be committed in, in, in terms of your, your contribution and, and, and trainings and meetings and the understanding. I mean, there's, a, there's a huge amount going into that. I mean, everyone's going to get the opportunity and we've got to give that message that uh, everyone will give the opportunity. And that's why looking at the squad and, the, and the, the players and the potential combinations that we've got, we think it's going to be really competitive and we think um, everyone hopefully is going to go out there with the, with the attitude that, hey, if uh, things go well enough for me, I'm, I'm good enough to start in the test.